Hey, it's Brickstar. We're going to look at another Lego Dino set from 2012. This is set 5886, the T Rex Hunter. 480 pieces. A big T Rex. Two minifigures. And a helicopter. This was for ages 7 to 12, so it's a little slightly more challenging build, but still a pretty easy set to build. Has a lot of stickers. And has the all-important T-Rex, which is actually a different T-Rex than we see in the other uh, dino set from 2012 that had the T-Rex, the, uh, the big dino set. So anyway, this is a pretty cool set, and let's look at it. So the main part of the set is the helicopter, which has been specially designed to pick up T-Rex, Tyrannosaurus Rex. And it's got like a grappling hook type thing that holds them. It's got flick fire missiles, which are for shooting the tranquilizers. It's got six blades. And we can turn it around. That T-Rex was loose. Let's look at it without the T-Rex. <laughs> Looks kind of empty. You got the chain that hangs down there with the hook. And what that's supposed to do is to hook here. So when the helicopter's flying away, it's got him. And then when he lands on him, like so, he can get him. And here is the cockpit area which opens up. It's just got the single joystick there the lever to control it there is a control panel in there don't know if you can see that that's about it that's actually this is supposed to be in that brick I hate this build of these I had a hard time with this so overall this is actually one of the larger helicopters that I built but it's still kind of I feel like I've left something out it falls apart too too easy it's supposed to clip there Put the engine back on there so it's got these kind of thrusters here I like the way the wheels set out wide like that. You could probably use it to pick up other cargo. So if you didn't have the dyno stickers on there, Aerial Capture Unit RP5886, you could use it maybe in Lego City to do some construction. It could be like a some kind of helicopter used for carrying heavy equipment around, picking up a tractor or something. Here are your two minifigures. Kind of give you an overview. A lot of good printing on the front and the back. This poor guy with the camera, he's got kind of a worried look on his face, but I mean, goodness, you should have a worried look. You're messing with dinosaurs. They both have their tranquilizer guns. This guy kind of looks like Anakin with that <laughs> on there, but and he's sweating. They don't have double-sided printing on these figures here on their heads, so it's just uh, that. But that, I think they did a good job with the torsos on these mini figures. Here's the little four-wheeler and its trailer um, this is the guy chasing I guess the T-Rex and he shot him and then the helicopter comes along and picks him up I'm guessing that's what happens so he's got this little four-wheeler not really much to it and then the trailer in the back it's got the all-important camera and some binoculars and it's very important you will be able to see the T-Rex when it's far away and then he's got the camera. Actually, you need to have the camera in the other hand. Let's do that. So, he's got the camera ready to take a picture. And what's he doing? His buddy's up there riding on the T-Rex. And he's uh, trying to do something to get a lot of views on YouTube. Probably get his buddy falling down off of it. Or perhaps getting eaten by the T-Rex. That would probably get a lot of views. So the poor old T-Rex, he's got this thing hooked on the back of him. 
you can take it off like so love the t-rex it's got a lot more range of motion than some of the early lego t-rexes move his head open his mouth it's fully compatible with minifigures you can get enough of a minifigure in there that he can hold them that's pretty cool so you get two instruction manuals um there's not really anything like two different parts because you're halfway through the helicopter before you go to the next one they could have probably just put it in one man uh, instruction manual i do like the pictures they have of the other sets and of the kind of activities going along with this set shows you some of the things you can do with it there it's got a good photograph here of the guy chasing the t-rex and then them catching the t-rex <laughs> And I think we got some pictures in the other one of the other sets. Maybe, yeah, this is the one that's got the pictures of the other sets. So it doesn't have all of the sets. It's missing the uh, that limited edition one, which we've already reviewed uh, with the airplane. But there's the the big research compound one. I forget what they call it. Um, Triceratops. We've reviewed that one. So the only two we got left to do is the velociraptor set there and then that one there as well so 5882 and 5884 so those will be in upcoming videos now the box is really big that's the front of the box and that is the back of the box it has some of the um, pictures that are on the instructions so that is t-rex hunter set 5886 Again, it was 480 pieces, two minifigures, the all-important T-Rex. Uh, we are going to be reviewing, again, some of the older Lego dino sets. And once we get some of those other dinosaurs built, we're going to do a comparison of the dinosaurs, such as the Spinosaurus from the Studio sets, the T-Rex from the Canister sets, and maybe even some of the other dinosaurs from the dino 2010 which I don't, i'm not crazy about those dinos but this is a really good t-rex uh, the dinosaurs in the dino 2012 sets are uh, among the best in the dino line so that's what i think this overall is a good set it was an expensive one it was like 70 dollars i would say i think when it was out which is kind of expensive for a 480 piece set but you're getting this dinosaur but now you can't even find this in the stores um, that I see anymore so even though it's only two years old it's hard to find and they do go very good on the reseller market the, the dino set our dino sets um, are really popular and they usually go for a lot on eBay so anyway that is another dino Lego set thanks for watching this video be sure to like it be sure to be subscribed so you won't miss my next dino review and check out uh, my playlist. I got a, If you look at my playlist, I have one for dino-related sets. I'll try to put a link in the description as well. Uh, so we've reviewed quite a few different sets that have dinosaurs in them. And we're going to be doing more. Thanks for watching. It's a good I love this dinosaur.